This segment of the news is brought to you by Great Basin College, a pioneer in distance education. Your success is their tradition. Now offering over 25 degree and certificate programs in Pahrump and online. And an Andre Butch Harper Act of Kindness Award was presented to Tyann James this afternoon at the Prump Rotary meeting. I don't, want to, I don't want to embarrass her by doing this, but I'm going to ask Deanne O'Donnell to come over here with me for just a second. <laughs> Deanne O'Donnell is always behind the camera, but she has done so much for our community. And I want everyone to know that the Butch Harper Act of Kindness Award would not exist today had it not been for her. She's the one that made it continue and she's the one who looks at it and, and helps me make the presentations. <laughs> so I just want to say thank you. thank you. Every Rotarian is someone who is truly deserving of a Butch Harper Act of Kindness Award. And today it is my honor to look around this room and say that today we're going to present the Butch Harper Act of Kindness Award to a young lady that has done a lot for our community as well, and her name is Tian James. So if she would just come on up. <laughs> I, I want to say too, now this says on here, Tian James, it says in memory of Andre Butch Harper, Act of Kindness Award presented to Tian James for your commitment to the residents of Pahrump, from the citizens of Pahrump, Nevada, and no act of kindness is ever wasted. So we want to present that to you. Thank you. That is... <laughs> and before, be, before I allow her to speak, I want to say that we presented an act of kindness award uh, last week, and I was looking at Tian, and I kept thinking, Gee, I could present her award today. But we wanted it to be a surprise at the Rotary meeting. So there, that's why it's here today. There are so many people that deserve it way above me. So that is, this is really special to me. Thank you so much. And you're special to us. Thank you. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. I'll treasure it. <laughs> you. Lots of things are up for auction this week. So here's Ron Chase to tell you all about it. This segment is sponsored by Nevada Public Auction. Big auction this weekend. Of course, we're getting close to Valentine's Day, so lots of really nice jewelry, a lot of home decor. Uh, there's some scarves, there's some perfumes, a lot of nice gifts, uh, again, for Valentine's Day. So all day Thursday, preview from 9 a.m. to 5.30. At 5.30, we start our coins, and then uh, 6.30, everything else. And like I said, all kinds of cool stuff here for uh, Valentine's Day. Very unique items. Lots of unique stuff. Again, like I said, it's... Um, Close to Valentine's Day, there's home decor, there's vases. Uh, like last week, there's lots of new um, uh, lights, fans, ceiling fans, uh, home decor, uh, home improvement stuff. A lot, a lot of good stuff this week. Super um, fun to look at, all these items. And very unique, um, like you said, for Valentine's Day, for gifts. So if you want to buy something that maybe for a guy, maybe for a girl, this is the place to come. We can cover you both ways. I've got yeah. ammo, we've got knives, we've got gorgeous jewelry, more than we usually have. And then uh, some interesting, like I said, home decor pieces, like this large... Um, uh, marine bell that's in here, uh, some elephant sculptures, some elephant pictures, all kinds of really unique stuff that you can't find anywhere else in Pahrump. Tell me about this artwork. So there's some cool artwork. Like there's at least uh, there's a John Lennon like framed uh, newspaper clipping. We've got two different elephants and some other really cool pieces you have to come down and take a look to appreciate them. So you can see all this online, right? That is a, that's correct. The auction is completely online. Auctionenv.com is the full catalog. But of course, if you're local, you want to come down and take a look here. But by all means, you can bid from the comfort of your own home if you yeah. choose to do so. If you want to get rid of your own stuff? Uh, one piece, a whole estate, whatever you got. I don't care if it's a container load. Give me a call here. It's a Nevada Public Auction. It's 751-4867. Website is auctionnv.com. And we're right off Highway 372, just past the hospital, 800 Margaret Street. Thank you. And let's join Chris and Emily with this week's student news. I'm Chris Blanchard. And I'm Emily Roberts. And, and this, this is, is your student, student news. news. Come on down to the high school auditorium this Friday at 6 for the Minute to Wait competition. And if you're feeling lucky, you can sign up to participate in Miss K's class. But make sure to hurry because there are only 20 spots left. If you like rodeos and bull riding, come and join the Pahrump Rodeo Club. The Rodeo Club meets Wednesdays at 5 in the Petrack Park Arena. So go join! 
Baseball preseason practice will be held here at the school Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays at 5 p.m. Online driver's education classes will begin February 7th at Great Basin College. So go sign up at gbcnv.edu slash driver's ed or call 775-753-2231. Hey, Chris. Yeah, Emily? What do you call a fake noodle? What? I'm impasta. <laughs> I'm Chris. And I'm Emily. And, and this, this is your student news. news. Thanks, kids. Well, the Miss Senior Golden Years pageant held a Victorian Tea Sunday at Desert Greens Clubhouse to gather contestant applications for this year's pageant. BJ Hedrick Irwin explains it all. Come on, yeah, you do have a lot to <laughs> Like I said, with the sun shining, it looks a little crazy with this hat and scarf, but it's really cute. Um, we're just living on our top, which is from a company called Illuminations, made in the USA. It's a size large, it's nice and lightweight, it's not a sweater, it's more like a t-shirt material, it's a size large. Well this is our annual Victorian tea that we have once a year to have the people understand what, what Miss Senior Golden Years USA is all about and, and our pageant is all about giving back to our community. And there are contestants, possible contestants in this room? Oh yes, I've already pointed them out. Yeah. And uh, yes, and, and uh, it, 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 it's a wonderful cause and, and our queen, that our reigning queen now, her platform was, was caregiver for seniors and she goes out to Evergreen, I don't think it's called Evergreen anymore, but participates with, with them there helping them out. But her platform is, and we will be meeting with the uh, administrator of, of the hospital, is starting a Pink Lady volunteer program out there. So we'll be meeting with her to get this implicated. We, we kind of settled down until all the, you know, the, the new people get understand into the hospital and understand what it's all about. Then we're going to go in and meet with her. Awesome. So we have um, all the lovely ladies who've competed before, who've won before, and then possible contestants. So how can a person become a contestant? Um, is it still available? Yes, it's still available. All they have to do is contact me at 727. 7011 and just come in here at our first meeting and uh, just call me and we'll open the doors to you and I promise I, I won't lock the door but I will listen but it, I think after you understand what it's all about you will be there. What's the criteria? All we want people to do is understand get out of your comfort zone it's your time in life. How old do you have to be? 60. 60 and above. Yeah, 60 and above. Yeah, yes. And so you can find out more by just giving BJ a phone call. When is the pageant? July the 8th at Saddle West Hotel and Casino. All right, so um, you have to get your applications in now? Oh, we have, we're passing them around, and I, I will make sure that there's some sign today. So we will see what happens. Such a lovely affair. It was. Yes. So much fun. And it's so nice to feel the temperatures rising, yeah. juxtaposed with that beautiful snow still on the mountains. Exactly. Yeah. Noah Began's going to tell us what we can expect in weather next.